Hello everyone, I am Trustwork44 and welcome to this Let's Play of Geneforge 5. Last episode, I believe we'd actually gone through Camp East Alpha here. Took a look through various things, saw what we could. Now, eh, let's take a look at what this pacification road is. We'll unlock access to this location here, and I like to unlock access to everywhere I can. So, on to pacification road. Alright, let's see here. Up, oh, rogues. Glocks. You hike into the more remote depths of the Dara Reaches. This barren expanse is far from any sizable source of water, and it shows. The sun beats down upon you harshly, and dust immediately starts to crust around your nostrils. And yet there is life, a bold testimonial to the cunning and steel of the Shapers. The trees they have created, part fungus, part cactus, grow all around you. They are parched, scraggly, and covered with thorns, but they live. And rogues live also. Created by rebels and sent into the wastes, packs of powerful creations walk up and down the roads looking for prey. They are completely rogue, maddened by thirst, and eager to attack anything they see. They will all be dead soon. And then, no doubt, a rebel lifecrafter will slip into the southern shore, make a host of creations, and send them out to fight and die. It is cruel, but that is war. It looks like the Shapers built several pacification pylons to secure the road, but from this distance it doesn't look like any of them are working. A typical failure for those devices. Without some sort of aid, clearing the roads on this road will be very, very difficult. Right, so we need to find those pacification pylons. Warning, deadly rogue infestation ahead. Use alternate route. Well, I think I saw something over here. Ah, yes, there's a structure over there. And a lot of glochs in there. Keep away from them. And move over to here. This is probably... Yes, use a couple living tools. Bingo! You enter a low building made of rough sta sandstone blocks. The humble structure contains a set of brand new, high-quality shaper machinery. There is a large pair... There is a pair of large crystals, fully charged with power and connected to a device by the back wall. The machine, however, is dormant. The heat and sand has gummed it up, and it sits there uselessly. You open a ha the hatch at the base of the device and look inside. What you see doesn't surprise you. The clockwork gears and crystal that channel the power from the crystals inside this building to the conduits outside are gummed up with sand and grit. When it gets too clogged, it shuts down automatically to protect the works. You might be able to clean it out and get power flowing again. It would only work for a short time, though. We'll get the machine running again. You grab a nearby brush and start scouring out the grit. You just barely have adequate skill and delicacy to clean the device out sufficiently without damaging it. Soon, with a little hum, the device starts power flowing again. However, a bit of dirt has been allowed to get deep into the works, and more of it is accumulating on the gears even as you watch. You suspect that this particular device will shut down again sometime in the near future. I imagine, then... And we can actually use this ac this opportunity to kill a few of these before it wears off. Patchwork Crusher. Ow. Oh, that's not too bad. He's fine. <laughs> Alright, we can probably kill a few of these while they're pacified. Oh yeah, this, this isn't going to be very bad at all. Ah, aside from the slowing, that is annoying. Yeah, kill a few of these while you can. I imagine there's probably going to be another somewhere to the south. It only makes sense. Excellent. All right, let's uh, let's go for another one. Another crusher. Come on, we can do this. Ooh, yeah, I can see there's another spot that we'd need to kill them over there. That one's dead. Eh, cover that one in lightning, why don't you? Erglach! Oh dear. Probably should not have gone for that now that I think about it. Oh dear! Oh dear! This is probably a poor choice. I think I might get a little stun locked. Oh dear, I did this wrong. I did this very, very wrong. Yeah, I'm badly stunned. Very badly stunned. 
Oh good, I'm not stunned. Uh... Ah, shit. Um... Um... See if you can kill it. Well, you did a number on it, at least. There, that one's dead. Oh, great. No, I'm definitely gonna be stun-locked. No, no, I'm actually gonna be killed. Damn it, I did this wrong, and I am going to die. <sighs> great. Well... Just great. Okay, give me a minute while I get back to that location and kill a similar amount of creatures. Ooh. Oh, the power in some of the nearby in some nearby conduits is starting to flicker. Okay, at the very least we can kill this one. Man, those conduits do not last long at all. Oh jeez. Oh jeez, I didn't even realize there was a spell there. Okay. We can kill this guy at least, I'm sure. Also, I managed to kill some of the Urglochs from up there. Nicely enough. <laughs> you no you no longer hear a hum from the nearby machinery. Good. Well, we killed a few of them and survived long enough. I need to keep my eye on that, otherwise things go very badly here. Hmm. Okay, let's try this again. Get the machine running again, and let's see how many of these we can kill this time. We'll focus on these, I think. They die easily. And they aren't that big a threat, in all honesty. Sure, they can hit fairly hard enough, I guess. They're not that big a deal. Hey, you level up for king. Nice. Hopefully this doesn't wake up that Urglach. If it does, we're gonna be in big trouble. Doesn't look like it did, which is good. Alright, stab the Urglach. Good. Cover it in lightning. Ooh, it appears to be stunned. Nice. And I think, I think we're gonna get it. Yeah, that's gonna die quickly. There we go, perfect. And now this guy. We kill it, and everything will be good on this pylon. I'm definitely gonna need to heal myself up, though. Perfect! One pylon completely cleared. I imagine there's probably... I'm guessing about three to go. Yeah, I can see another pylon right here. Alright. Alright, let's open this one. Yeah, two living tools. I'd like more mechanics if I could. Ooh, yay, another living tool to make up for one we lost. Alright. Get the machine running again. Now. Let's see how many of these we can kill, eh? Start with these, of course. Because they are a huge annoyance and threat. Yeah, that one's gonna die easily. Next turn. We don't even need to hit it again. Oh, boy. That's not good. Okay. What the? No longer hear a hum already? How did that thing wear off so quickly? That's... How did that... <sighs> we weren't close enough. Damn it. Okay. We need to kill that Urglach. Now. That thing survives. It's going to keep me stunlocked. Ah. Oh, jeez. Okay, okay. Kill it. There we go. Okay. Could have gone a bit better, but I think that went well enough, all things considered. Come on, we got this. And that one's dead. Okay. There's two more down there. Uh, let me heal myself first, just to be safe. And move forward a bit. There we are. Oop. Ah, this slow is ruining everything. Okay, something is coming to attack. Ah, it's that Urglach. Oh, and the Crushers saw me too. Oh, great. Okay. Focus on the Urglach, if you could. Thank you. You can actually do something about that, I think. 
Yeah, this Urglach won't last long. I might actually die next round. Or not. Oh well, it's fine. Uh, King, finish him off. Thank you. Hey, we leveled up! Nice. Alright then. Could use a couple healings. Actually, what are we going to improve? Let me think. You know, dexterity might be a decent thing to improve, I think. Though I really just want one more point in mechanics, in all honesty, if I could, but... Mm... Dexterity, sure. It'll help us out a lot. There we are. Oh. Alright, kill that crusher. Kill him. Now I wonder if you can actually make, uh, these patchwork crushers in the game. Like, if I could and did, I'd probably name it Wesley. My god, that pun was horrible, but I am not ashamed. <laughs> okay. Well, there's the south exit. We kinda know it's down there. Oh, hey! Pacification Road can be crossed freely. Uh, I see another crusher over there. Oh, there's one. Okay, fine. Kill it. Oh, jeez. Stay away from out there, because I do not want them all to swarm me and destroy me. Uh-oh. Oh, dear. This is bad. This, this is very bad. Especially with two of those. And we're all slowed. Alright, um, I'm gonna need to use some items. I don't want to use that, but... Alright. Cast that. Uh... What the hell? Cast again. Hey, that killed one of them. And... There, that's... That's... That's actually almost dead. Okay. We should be able to kill those two. Ow, 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 ow. Yeah, that one's gonna die. Yeah, that one's dead. Oh, jeez. Ah, crap, I'm about to die, aren't I? Okay, at the very least... There. Please tell me I can go. Oh, thank Christ. Uh, I don't want to use this, but I have to. There. Okay. These things do hit hard once they swarm you a bit. And they are focusing on King a lot. One full volley is enough. We don't really have any major healing spores. Fine. Restoration spores to heal all of us. There. Yeah, yeah, you can attack me. King is terrified. Oh, great. Just, just great. Oh, not anymore. Okay, that Patchwork Crusher is gonna die in the next round, I'm certain of that. No, I just realized, these things don't actually have heads. They're just... a body with legs. How the hell... Eesh. These things are weird. Really weird. Okay, that one is gonna die. Probably next turn. King is in trouble, but I think we can finish these off without a problem. Alright, we almost got it. Almost got it. That one's wounded. Ah, I should have fired the lightning. There we go. Okay. Hey boy, that went uh, harder than I expected. Ooh, uh, definitely heal. There we go. Okay. They were guarding a canister and various things that we don't need. Well, at least we got experience, and experience is always nice. Uh. What else are we going to look at now? Um, 
actually, I think what I'm going to do is make a quick walk out. I should not have used that. I'm just going... Mm, no, 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 I'm going to leave it. Uh, let me just... Let the... There, slow is gone. Now let's see if we can see what's up in here. Oh, there was only one creation up in there. Okay, good. Uh, ah, good. Restoration. Submission. Good, good. Okay, I think there's only one other pylon here, it looks like, and that's way over there, so we can probably do something about it easily. But there's also a building here, interestingly, and interestingly enough. Well, first, disarm the mines, of course. There we are. And what is back here? Why do I have the feeling it's going to be something... What the... Shaper Ghost? Oh dear. I did not expect to see ghosts. This is unexpected. It hits hard too! Oh jeez. Well, we should probably stay away from here in all honesty, considering how hard these guys hit. And I don't think we really do enough damage to kill them. I'm probably actually going to die next round. Yeah, I think I am going to die next round. This... This is bad. Yeah. Okay, what is in these? Let's see. Fine Cloak Robe, Wand of Curses, and on the Guardian's Corpse... Reapers, shaped lance, coins, heavy chit, and armor. Nothing of use. So, this was actually a completely pointless battle. Yeah. Okay, we'll stay away from those ghosts. Alright, now then. Get the machine running again, and run out to kill those things before they all wake up. Starting with these. They are the biggest annoyance. Actually, that one we can leave, and we can attack the other one. Ah, great. All slowed. Just what I bloody wanted. Really, really hate this slow. Oh, god damn it. Really hate these things. Power in some nearby conduits is starting to flicker. Alright, um... Everyone run back. I want to get away. Seriously? Yeah, let the electricity kill it. Yeah. Let the power run out. Actually, you know what? Let the slow run out. Okay, the machinery wore off, and... Come on. How long does the slow... There we go. Bloody hell. Alright. Now. Let's see how many we can kill. Starting with this one. Because... We can kill these. Oh jeez, there's a fourth over there? Oh god. I didn't even realize this. Oh dear. And there's probably going to be a bit of, be a bit of crossover. Okay, I think we can at least lure one of those over, I think. Actually... You know what? There! There, one came over. Good. Oh dear. Too many are coming over. Oh, this is bad. This is very bad. I think we might get a little overwhelmed here. Okay, that's dead. Good. King, however, is in big trouble. Right. King, I'm a coming. Okay, we can at least take out these, which is very good. That one's gonna die next round, I imagine. I hope. King's in trouble. But I think he'll be able to survive at least one more round. Okay, that one is gonna die. There we are. Okay. The power in some nearby conduits is almost gone. Yeah, I figured. I did not expect that. How the hell do you get around that? That last one is just... ridiculous. 
Okay. Power running again. Kill this one. I think we can sneak around the side there, at least. Yeah, I think we can sneak around there. Around here, I mean. Okay. Yes, I see that shield dropped. Aha! That's probably it. Power in some nearby machinery starting to flicker, of course. And we are not going to go up there. Alright, that one... Yeah, that one goes down to there. Good. Trick is, it's going to take forever to get down there. Ooh. Couple crystals to sell, so at least we'll get some loot from this. Okay. Alright, now for this one. Alright, get over there, get over there, get over there. Hurry, 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 hurry. Right. We need to kill that. It is the biggest threat. The biggest annoyance. And it looks like there's an eastern egg entrance there? Odd. That one must have been from the other pylon, I'm guessing. Right, kill as many of these as you can. There we are. There we are. Now for this crusher. I see an Urglock shield. At least I'm pretty sure that's what it is. It only makes sense. Oh, there's still a, an Urglock up there. Okay. No biggie. Power in some nearby conduits is starting to flicker. No worries, we're way over here, we'll be fine. And... That one's dead. Okay. Uh... You know what, since we're over here, yeah. You! You we are going to kill! Oh, great. Not what I wanted, really. Really not what I wanted. Fine. Start biting it. Eat the thing! Swallow him! Consume his flesh! Eat him, king! Good king. And while you feast on his corpse, I'll just take a look at his shield. Uh, Glock shield. Plus 12 armor, plus 40 stun resistance. It's basically a big armor stun resist thing. It's going to be sold. Alright. King, y'all full? Good boy. Here, have a healing spell. <laughs> uh, I think we've actually killed most of these creations. Let's see, kill this one. Oh, I see something down there, but I can't actually see it. Oh, it's another Urglach. Okay. Cover it in lightning. Good boy. And there. And this should kill that. Oh, it survived. Uh, you know what? It'll be fine. King, why don't you cover that one in like... Oh, you couldn't get to it. Too stunned. Oh well, no biggie. That one's going to die soon. There we go. And now, King... Ah, she's still stunned. Jeez, those things have a lot of stun. I mean... <laughs> I knew they stunned a lot, but I didn't realize just how much. Yeesh! There we go. Okay, looks like the paths are pretty much all cleared. Let's see, this leads to... Kyar's Spire, Cell Block Deliveries Access. Kyar's Spire. Who the hell is Kyar? Oh, there's not much else around here except over here. Which is... Sure, use another two living tools. Oh good, we get a replacement living tool. There we are. And in here... Yeah, as expected. That probably just affects those two. Alright, and out in the east here is... Kyre's Spiral Cell. So, still don't know who Kyre is, but I imagine we'll find out eventually. For now, we'll do some healing, and we'll probably take a look at this Spire entry with. Actually, I think next we'll probably go to the Purity Workshop. 
we do have a quest for that. But for now, a couple of things to sell. Okay, I think that'll be enough for now. Uh, is that person? No, it's just a town woman. Okay, uh, that that went well, I think. Yeah, that went uh, fairly well. Plenty of killing, plenty of stuff done, all sorts of stuff like that. All is well. All is very, very nice. Next episode... Yeah, we'll go to the Dara Purity Workshop. We got a quest out there. Why the hell not? It's, it's something easy to do. So, yeah. That'll be in the next episode. So, until then, I am Chester44, that is E-King and Shuriken. This has been Eugene Forge 5 Let's Play, and I will see you all next time.